Hello and welcome. With Blender and Prainstar, you can import sculpt maps created by any other 3D editor. The easiest way to import your Sculpty is by using the Second Life Sculpty importer from File, Import, Second Life Sculpty. All you need is a copy of the Sculpt map either in TGA format or in PMG format. This import works as long as the imported sculpt map follows exactly the rules. Some sculpt maps however have issues with the seams, and when importing those sculpt maps to Blender, the problem will become instantly visible. If you examine the object closely, you may find a gap where you actually expected the object to be closed. If you have this problem with your sculpty imports, then Primstar has got something for you. You can fix this gap with no effort. Here I show you how to do that. First, you need to determine the original stitching type of your object. In my example the stitching type is cylindrical, and therefore I now create a simple base cylinder. And because all Sculptmap imports are set up with multi-rays, I also take care to configure my cylinder to use it. Now I switch to edit mode, and there I select all vertices. Ensure that you are in edit mode, then follow. Mesh, Scripts, Update from Sculpty. Navigate to your Sculpt map and select it for import. This step copies the data of the broken Sculpty into our new cylinder. Now the Sculpty shape has replaced the simple cylinder. and the gap in the mesh has been corrected. You probably will want to propagate the correction to the sculpt map, therefore you bait the sculpt map again. And now also the sculpt map is correct. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.